now the latest around the wide world of tropics. Tropical Weather Bulletin for August 9th. Tropical Storm Kevin is still going strong. Lupit is now extra tropical and Mirane is also still a tropical storm on day 221 of the year. 50 storms have formed so far on August 9th, 2021. Although it's day 69 in the Atlantic, it is far from a nice day here as two invests, 93 and 94L, are causing havoc in this part of the world. 93L is at a 40% chance of formation and 94L remains slightly higher at a 50% chance of formation. Day 85 in the Eastern Pacific has quite the hive of activity. Starting things off with Kevin, still maintaining tropical storm strength, expected to become a hurricane fairly soon. Uh, 93E is also going strong with a 90% chance of formation within the next five days. And finally, 91C is currently at a 50% chance of formation. But the question remains, will it become Hone or Omice? Uh, in the, over in the Western Pacific, Lupit is now extra tropical. Mirane is still going fairly strong east of Honshu. 92W was also just designated and will begin to head northwest. And there are the, there's the remains of 91C crossing over into the Western Pacific with its 50% chance. Monsoonal activity is still ongoing over in the North Indian Ocean. Nothing tropical is active, as is the norm for this time of year. It's the same story over in the Southwest Indian Ocean. There is nothing happening in this part of the world due to it being winter in the Southern Hemisphere. 93L is slowly getting its act together. 94L is also getting there. Uh, having a wide formation area and they have a 40 and 50 percent chance of formation respectively. There also appears to be another wave coming off of Africa but that does not have a formation chance just yet. Tropical Storm Kevin is making its way westwards expected to become a hurricane fairly soon. 93E follows behind it with its 90 percent chance. What could happen to 93E? Tropic Storm Mirane is making its way away from Japan. It will turn extratropical fairly soon. Uh, speaking of extratropical systems, uh, Lupit is now making its way across Japan as an extratropical system. And 92W is right next to the Philippines, just newly designated with its 10% chance of formation. The North Indian is all quiet, as is the norm for this time of year. As you can see, there's honestly not a lot of monsoonal activity right now. It's almost fairly clear. Over in the sea surface temperatures, the Western Pacific is mostly hovering around 29 degrees with some pockets of 30. The North Indian is currently registering around 27, 28 degree temperatures. Uh, the tropical Atlantic has temperatures of around 29. The Gulf of Mexico is largely 30 degrees. The tropical Eastern Pacific is also uh, 28 to 29 degrees. The subtropical Eastern Pacific is registering temperatures of the low to mid 20s. Sea surface temperature anomalies now. The Eastern Pacific, the area from Baja California all the way to Hawaii still remains cooler than average. The Atlantic subtropics are above average, uh, some parts by quite a bit, as you can see. Uh, the tropical spots of the Atlantic mostly at or above. Uh, the West Pacific also remains warmer than average, apart from the area of Okinawa, which remains cooler than average due to the passage of uh, Typhoon Infa. Uh, the North Indian is also mostly above average, apart from the West Central Arabian Sea and the Sea of Japan remains abnormally above average. On this day in 2006 brings us Super Typhoon Saomai, uh, hopefully I pronounced that correctly, which reached peak intensity today and 
close by is Tropical Storm Bofa, which would make landfall in Taiwan today at its current status. All right, next up in the Atlantic Storm naming list is Fred followed by Grace. We could be seeing those names fairly soon. Up next in the Eastern Pacific is Linda and Marty. We could be seeing one of those two fairly soon. And it's like we're a broken record right now. The next st uh, storm in the Central Pacific is Honei, but we may not be saying that for too much longer. Here's hoping. Up next in the West Pacific, we have uh, Amace up next, followed by Konson. Up next in the North Indian is Gulab, followed by Shaheen. First up in the Southwest Indian is Anna, followed by Batsirai. Uh, up next in the Australian region is Paddy, followed by Ruby. And finally, up next in the South Pacific is Cody, followed by Dovi. That's all from me for now. We'll see you for a Tropical Weather Bulletin tomorrow night.